Padang, Indonesian pronunciation, Pada, is the capital of the province of West Sumatra in Indonesia, with an area of 695 square kilometers, 268 square miles, and a population of 1,096,000 in 2014. It is the 16th most populated city in Indonesia, the most populated city on Sumatra's western coast, and fifth most populated city on Sumatra. The city had historically been a trading center since the pre-colonial era, trading in pepper and gold. The Dutch made contact with the city in the mid-17th century, eventually constructing a fortress and taking over control of the city from the Pagarian Kingdom. Save several interruptions of British rule, Padang remained part of the Dutch East Indies as one of its major cities until Indonesian independence. History Padang has been a trade center since the 16th century, having been controlled by the Pagarian Kingdom and the Aceh Sultanate. During the 16th and 17th centuries pepper was cultivated and traded with India, Portugal, the United Kingdom and the Netherlands. In 1663 the city came under the authority of the Dutch and a trading post was built in 1680. The city came under the British Empire twice, firstly from 1781 to 1784 during the Fourth Anglo-Dutch War, and again from 1795 to 1819 during the Napoleonic Wars. In 1819 the city was transferred back to the Netherlands. Up to circa 1780 the most important trade product was gold originating from gold mines in the region. When the mines were exhausted, the focus turned to other products such as coffee, salts and textiles. In 1797 Padang was inundated by a tsunami with an estimated flow depth of 5 to 10 meters, following an earthquake, estimated to be 8.5 to 8.7 mw, which occurred off the coast. The shaking caused considerable damage and the deaths of two people, while the tsunami resulted in several houses being washed away and several deaths at the village of Air Manis. Boats moored in the Arau River ended up on dry land, including a 200-ton sailing ship which was deposited about 1 km upstream. In 1833 another tsunami inundated Padang with an estimated flow depth of 3 to 4 meters as a result of an earthquake, estimated to be 8.6 to 8.9 mw, which occurred off Bengkulu. The shaking caused considerable damage in Padang, and due to the tsunami boats moored in the Arau River broke their anchors and were scattered. The population of Padang in 1920 was 28,754, the second largest city in Sumatra behind Palembang. At the time of independence in the 1940s the city had around 50,000 inhabitants. Coffee was still important, but copper was also a major item produced by farmers in its hinterland. The population growth since then has been partly a result of growth in the area of the city, but largely as a result of the migration to major cities seen in so many developing nations. From 1950 the Ombilan coal field developed with Padang as its outlet port. This was seen by some observers as reflecting the economic and political colonization of Indonesia. On 30 September 2009, a 7.9 magnitude earthquake hit about 50 kilometers off the coast of Padang. There were more than 1,100 fatalities, 313 of which occurred within Padang. Geography Climate Padang features a tropical rainforest climate under Köppen's climate classification. Padang is one of Indonesia's wettest cities, with frequent rainfall throughout the course of the year. The city averages roughly 4,300 mm of rain per year. Padang's driest month is February, where 250 mm of precipitation on average is observed. The city temperatures are relatively constant throughout the year, with an average of 26 degrees Celsius. Governance by 2007 the city government began a number of religiously motivated policies. One requires females of all religious backgrounds who are municipal employees and students in government schools to wear jibab, hijab, and high school students now take classes on reading the Quran. Municipal employees are required to pay zakat. 
Administrative districts The city of Padang is divided into 11 districts Kekamatan, Bungas Telik, Kabing Koto, Tanga, Karanji, Lubuk, Begalung, Lubuk, Kalangan, Nongolo, Padang, Barat, Padang, Selatan, Padang, Timur, Padang, Utara, Pa Adipura Award as of 2017. Padang had received the Adipura Cleanest and Greenest City Award in the category of Large City 18 times and the Adipura Kenkana Award 3 times. Culture cuisine The cuisine of the Manangkabao people is commonly called Padang cuisine. Padang restaurants are common throughout the country and are famous for their spicy food. Padang food is usually cooked once per day, and all customers choose from those dishes, which are left out on display until no food is left. It is served in small portions of various dishes, but constituting, with rice, a complete meal. Customers take, and pay for, only what they want from this array of dishes. The best known padang dish is rendang, a spicy meat stew. Soto padang, crispy beef and spicy soup, is local residents' breakfast favorite. Meanwhile, sat beef satay in curry sauce served with katupat is a treat in the evening. Tourism padang is a common transit point for surfers traveling to Batu Islands and Muntawai Islands, and for tourists visiting the West Sumatran Highlands. Padang Beach, known as Taplao or Tapi Lawak, which located from Samudra Street until Perua, is well known for its beautiful sunset and hundreds of food stalls. Karanji River flows in Padang and on top area of the river at Batu Busak, Lambung Bukit subdistrict is suitable for white water activities. Bungus Bay, to the south of Padang, is suitable for swimming and boating. There are some pleasant offshore islands near Bungus, such as Sikui Island and Pagong Island. Many beautiful spots which can be visited for snorkeling, fishing or just relaxing on the white sandy beaches. Currently, Regional Development Planning Board BAPEDA, of Padang has established development plans Padang Old City, in Kampung Pondok, South Padang District as a tourist area. Mayor of Padang has been designate 73 historic buildings as cultural heritage of Padang. Landmarks There are many old buildings in Padang that still retain their Dutch and Chinese architecture. The old city of Padang, located next to Mawaro Harbor at Arau River, which formerly functioned as the city's main commercial avenue. The old city was the former business district of Padang. There are many important buildings such as Padang City Hall, De Javaska Bank, Present Day Bank Indonesia, Nederlandsch Spaarbank, Gia Wari & Co., Eskompto Machapij Office, Warehouses, and Merchant Houses. There are several historic places such as Adikiwarman Museum which specializes in the history and culture of the local Manangkabau ethnic group, and the main exhibits are housed within a Rumah Gadang-style building. Grand Mosque of West Sumatra, a new modern large mosque that is built with Manangkabau architecture. The mosque is located on Jalan Katib Sulaiman, city center of Padang. Ganting Grand Mosque, the oldest mosque in Padang and one of the oldest in Indonesia, is a popular tourist attraction. Mohammedan Mosque, founded by Indian merchant, is also located in the city center. St. Leo Monastery features a mixture of traditional Minang architecture on its bell tower roofing and Dutch architecture on the church building, is one of the oldest churches in Padang. Along the beachside road, just down from the tourist information office is a Buddhist temple, Vihara Buddha Warman, opened in 2006 for the large Chinese Buddhist community. Beaches and parks Air Manus Beach, Sweet Water Beach is located 10 km south of Padang, location of the legendary Malan Kundong Stone. The rock formations are found which resemble shipwrecks. Across from the Arau River is the city Nerbaya Park which can reached by bridge or boat. There are still remains of Japanese cannons and bunkers from World War II. There are great views of Padang City, Arau River and the Indian Ocean. Bung Hada Nature Reserve Taman Hutan Raya Bung Hada, is situated 18 km east of the city, with diverse flora and fauna including a few Sumatran tigers, tapirs, wild goats, bears, as well as Raflesia Gaduanzi, Balangphora, and Amorphopolis. Shopping Padang also has some modern malls, the most popular malls are Transmart, Vasco Grand Mall, SPR Plaza, Plaza Andalas, and Rocky Plaza. The upcoming malls in the city are Padang Landmark Mall and Padang Green City. Sports Padang is the home town of the soccer team Seaman Padang, with Haji Agus Salim Stadium being the home stadium of the club. Padang is home to an annual international dragon boat competition. 
Infrastructure Public transport the Transpadang Bus Rapid Transit Service was developed used Jakarta's TransJakarta system as a model, but without a dedicated lane and comfortable shelters. Today Transpadang runs only from Lubuk Buaya to Pasar Raya, a distance of 18 kilometers, with a fleet of 10 large buses, capacity 60, and 15 medium buses, capacity 40. Daily passengers number 7,000 in Corridor 1, an increase from the initial ridership of 4,000. The load factor is 128% in the morning and evening rush hours. Airport The city is served by the newly opened Manangkabau International Airport in Ketaping, Padang Parayaman. It replaces the old Tabang Airport, which is currently used as a military base. There is one terminal building for both international and domestic flights. The airport has four aerobridges, 17 check-in counters, five baggage conveyors, and nine ticket sales counters. In late 2013, the runway was lengthened by 250 meters so that it could accommodate Boeing 747 and Airbus A340 planes, and there is also a plan to connect the airport to the city of Padang with a train service. A terminal expansion, Phase 2, has been announced with the rendering already released on the Ancasa Pura 2 website. Seaport Padang's Telic Bayer Harbor, the former Emmahaven port, is the largest and busiest harbor on the west coast of Sumatra. It serves inter-island as well as international routes. It was built in 1888 by the colonial government of the Netherlands. On 29 April 2013 a new container terminal was officially opened by West Sumatra Governor which can hold more than 4,000 containers in 46,886 square meter area. The port is the main gateway to the Muntawai Islands, including Sibirut, Sipora, and South Pagai. There are also ferry connections between Padang to Jakarta and Sibolga next to Gunung Sitoli, Nias. Toll Road West Sumatra administration has secured lands for the construction of a 27-kilometer toll road between Padang and Sisinsan district with about Rp. 1.3 trillion $141.7 million investment. 80% of the land with a width of 30 meters has been acquired, but they will acquire more land to meet an ideal width of 50 meters. The construction project will be initialized in 2012. Railroad Railroad tracks connect Padang to Parayaman to the north, Padangpanjang to the northeast, Solak and Sawalunto to the east. The largest train station is Padang Station, known as Simpang Haru Station. Sibinwang and Dang Tuanku provides the trip services from Padang Simpang Haru, to Parayaman vice versa. Tsunami Shelter Government and the people of Hill Pangalan has agreed to make Mount Pangalan as tsunami shelter. Better road access to the hill will be built, as well as temporary shelters, including their facilities. Education Manangkabau people highly respect education. Many intellectual figures come from West Sumatra. There are two institutes of higher education in Padang, i.e. Andalas University and the State University of Padang. Andalas University is the oldest university in Indonesia outside of Java. The main campus is located at Lamau Manis, about 12 kilometers (7.5 miles) from the center of Padang. The Faculty of Medicine and Faculty of Dentistry are located in the city center, near the Central General Hospital M. Jamil. State University of Padang, located in Air Tawar. The other universities in Padang are Imam Banjal State Institute of Islamic Literature, Institut Technologi Padang in Lapai, Bung Hatta University in Ulak Karang, Baitarama University in Air Paka, Universitas Putra Indonesia YPTK, Ekasakti University, Universitas Muhammadiyah Sumatera Bharat, and Tamansiswa University. The local library of West Sumatra, located in Padang is considered as one of the best libraries in Indonesia, with the number of collection of 30k titles, including facilities and maximum conserve, and the highest number of encyclopedic visitors. Sister cities and twin towns See also 
List of twin towns and sister cities in Indonesia References Notes External links In Indonesian, official website Padang Travel Guide from Wikivoyage Informasi Padang Informasi Minang